Boys, we don't have long, so we might as well beat this on half cash, you know? Might as well, might as well just take it down. There we go, the double spike piles. More than enough to have us save up for Sada. And as much as I like auto start rounds, it's a no-go. We're just saving up for Sada. We're gonna plop her right there. Or there. Either works. Kinda like. Kinda like right here. You know? You guys know. Oh, didn't even need a Sada ability. Let's go. Gotta be on top of the quick shots. There we go. Guess we didn't really need to be on top of it because uh, it was in between the rounds, but we're ready anyway. Yo, what's up, tippers? Oh, big batch. How you doing? How's my favorite streamer doing? I'm doing pretty well. Thanks for asking. I do have to go to volleyball, though. So... I don't know. Oh, oh, we'll get this night. It will not. Feels bad. But uh, I do have to go to volleyball tonight. So we'll see how long I'm on. How's my favorite X Factor Rowan? Dude, we're going pretty well. Oh, should probably get this guy. Here's speed. Hey, I got to like round 95 on this with Geraldo and I'm still crying until now. All right, well, we got this oh i should not have done that bad timing they got past sada because of that feels bad i liked what we were doing last time i think instead of a second recursive if we go a never miss we win win the whole thing you know Yo, what's up sheesh you have a vendetta against sada <laughs> why <laughs> what happened did she hurt you Hmm, worth. Oh, we're getting close. We're getting close to this upgrade. I'll take that. I'll take that all day. Yo, what's up, Fireset? Hey, I'm here from YouTube and I've the past few streams. Nice to catch another one. Well, welcome back. Hopefully we can uh, we can beat X Factor half cash today and get that nice little black border. My f uh, my friend left the game because of her, saying maps are too easy. Understandable, understandable. Tibbers, you're tr you're right. Add time powers me up, and we would have beaten it. Do we normally we normally get a sniper? Snipers are cool. Chimps is gone. We already beat chimps. All we have left is half cash for this black border. Yes, sir. We beat it like a week ago. Nice video. Thank you. If you're talking about the new tournament video, I was pretty happy with how that one turned out. What's my favorite hero? Pat Fusty, baby. Pat all the way. He's the man. Super good strats. Super cool. I have audio off, so I don't know what he sounds like. Apparently, that's uh, only people's complaint. All right, let's get uh, a ninja right there. Yeah, he's good. He's strong. What more do you want in a monkey, you know? Pat Fussy Supremacy? Heck yeah. Heck yes. All right, we kind of have the early game figured out. Here we go. Got I uh, got the swords down. I don't know what we did different, but we still have full lives. We're doing something better. Uh, why does Pat float on water? No, he's just that big. He's just that big. They gave uh, Pat a questionable voice actor to nerf him and keep the meta in check. That's probably why they did it yeah because without that he was definitely gonna be the most popular thing ever i see that micro that was insane i'm out of my mind i can't be stopped today 
it's taking out the second dart remember well even with taking out the second dart we were still losing lives though that was a huge improvement whoever gave that suggestion was a genius I wasn't sure if I should have gone Caltrops or Full Metal Jacket first, but I'm okay with going this so far. Seems to be all right. Hey man, first time catching you live. Have a nice stream. Yo, Kron. Thanks, man. Welcome in. Welcome, welcome. That makes sense. He can be, because he can be a water tower. Yeah, Pat's cracked. He needed the voice actor nerf. Yo, what's up, Yeedy? How you doing? Or is it Yeedle? Yeedle. How you doing? All right, we're doing significantly better than ever before, and I'm a fan. I'm a big fan. <coughs> we're kind of hauling. Um, do we go straight for double shot? I think we do. I think that's the play. Double shot into a two zero three bomb shooter, maybe. I think that's what we were doing. Sadly, you can't come to any more Monday streams anymore. That is a feels bad, man. You will be missed. There is a good chance that there'll be more streams. I think the game plans, you know how I've been like entertaining the thought of doing more streams per week. So I think what I'm going to do is just stream several days a week uh, for a little bit, not commit to anything, but just see how much I like it, you know? Maybe stream like five nights a week for a little bit. See what happens. That way you guys can, uh, even though if you miss Monday, you can still catch a few. Everyday streams, but 10 minutes each. Pop on, say hi, beat like rounds one through 10, leave. That would be funny, actually. Ooh, there's no way we can get to a balloon jitsu in time. So let's just uh, get that bad guy up and running. You wish you could come to the streams uh this saturday stream dude saturday streams are are the longest and probably the best just because we would take down the boss and then hop into uh what we do like today mm. i mean we do, we do beat it assuming we pop all the camos we do beat this round good okay just making sure we aren't leaking more daddy is always better <laughs> okay fair I guess I can't argue with that one. No complaints on my end. Can we get cluster bombs this round? Wow. What are the odds? You have drills so you can't make it? That is understandable. That is understandable. I don't really know what drill is. I know a lot of my friends were in the Air National Guard in college, and I never asked them what all it entailed. <gasps> We actually leaked. We lost five lives. Hopefully that doesn't happen anymore. Well, let's just get heavy bombs. Questionable. What's questionable? All right, let's get Bloon Jitsu. Bloon Jitsu makes this an easy win. Though I'm not sure if I was supposed to go straight for Bloon Jitsu. Oh, well. There we go. We did something different. Do you think the new hero is broken? Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The new hero, Geraldo, is kind of a beast. Kind of an absolute unit. I just don't really know how to use him on half cash or would be using him here, you know? Plus Sada just makes the early game so easy. And even the mid game, which is all you have to go through. Oh my goodness. What is going on there? Oh, so many got through there. I guess I should have given this guy camera detection. Supernova, that's the worst take I've ever seen. Oh my goodness. This guy needs a balloon jitsu ASAP. Okay. All right, just like that, we're down to 42 lives. That's crazy. Anyway, at least we have this guy up. You can still one TC. That's cool. I didn't see that when it came out. I don't think being able to one TC really, really means you're amazing, but he is super good and he can. 
Oh my goodness, get over there, Sada. What's going on? We need, do we want another cluster bomb or do we want to start the ace? I'm gonna start the ace. And we're actually gonna skip the top path and go straight for never miss. If we get a never miss, we win, guaranteed. That's just how it works, I don't make the rules. However, saving up for two grand, saving up two grand is not an easy task in half cash. Yeah, I think we lose right here. Woo, said the liar. All right, if we were to sell stuff, hypothetically, of course, this is 550 plus 460, so that's one grand. Oh, consider it done. All right, our lead popping power was significantly reduced there. Significantly. We still have a bomb shooter. Now we have to decide if rapid fire is worth it or if we get camo detection on the ace and the bomb shooter. Hmm. Or we get another bomb shooter. So anyway, I upgraded the ace. Now, probably an elk. An elk is really good. Elk in a village. Assuming we beat this round. Lots of ceramics. Dang, even with a sword lunge, we needed an elk. I didn't see we had 1500. All right, we got this. We got this down, boys. You know, for the first round of the day, that was a lot closer than I was expecting. You know? Ooh. All right, after this, we can get the Sauda. Elk buffed, never misses OP. Yeah, I mean, it would have helped with the ceramics because of AMD, but we couldn't get to a, uh, we couldn't get to a, was it Berserker Brew in time? Why not a boomerang monkey? I mean, we could, it's just the middle just absolutely destroys its uh, bounces, doesn't it? I have no idea. Sometimes using powers or instas in half cash is justified. Never. Not today, at least. We can do this. I believe. Honestly, if the middle does not take out, um, if the middle doesn't take it out. All right, let's go to sandbox. Oh, here we go. That's what I meant. So you're telling me if I get like a 302 boomerang, it just goes hard. Let's just do like 55. It won't pop it, but. Hmm. It does just go, doesn't it? Maybe we work that in. Interesting. What if we go like uh, one, two, three, and just send 900, 199 pinks? Let's see what it looks like. Oh, the big whiff. You call that the Boltrix whiff? Hmm. It is all right. I have no complaints. I suppose we could open our daily chest. Nice. Oh, I meant to continue. There we go. Everything in his shop is way too cheap. Time with Geraldo. Yeah, they either have to hit him with price nerfs or power nerfs, one of the two. And an XP nerf, he levels up too fast. He's basically gonna have to get nerfed around the board or just continue being way too strong. There we go, we didn't let any on Sada side leak and we popped almost all over here. That was nice. Round 10, I think we handled pretty well. We might have to use the Sada ability at the end. We'll see. Believe in the power of, for of the force. 
Oh, I do. I watched all the Star Wars. Every single one of them. That's the one you went with? Sada, you have failed me. There was one where this blue is and she targeted down here. That was a scam. An absolute scamazing if I've ever seen one. Oh, well, I should have waited for the yellows. That's on me. Well, we're about to get all of our stuff back. Yo, what's up, Fireboy? How you doing? We're just trying to get our black border quick before I have to go to volleyball. So we started an early stream. I was about to cancel, but I figured mine as well. I might as well uh, get the dub quick. You guys know how it is. There we go. Sniper just makes the early game so easy. As long as you can, uh, as long as you can afford it. Half cash is harder than chimps, dude, most of the time. On the beginner maps, I don't think it is just because you can get Ben super easily. Um, as long as you have a good amount of monkey knowledge. But on the, on the harder maps, I think half cash is harder. Yeah, the half cash early game is tough. Doing good, just watched the new YouTube video. Wasn't surprised. Yeah. It was gonna be one of those top three for sure. Ryan had him. Ryan had him. I thought I thought I said was gonna go down to the loser's bracket for sure there. I feel like half cash is harder on the more middle difficulty maps. I mean, I guess I haven't done all the experts yet. I struggled with it on um I definitely struggled with Dark Castle half cash more than I did uh, the chimps. So that's kind of what I'm basing it off of. All right. I think we went Caltrops and then FMJ. Dark Castle is like beginner difficulty. <laughs> I think the only two half caches I've done on expert maps were um, Dark Castle and Infernal. So we're going to have a gauntlet of ones to go through. All right, let's get Caltrops so we can take down most rounds. And then get FMJ. Oh, well, big batch. If you include powers and ancestors, then yes, half cache is much easier. The selling is uh, is what makes it. It makes it much more flexible. The no selling in chimps is actually brutal a lot of the time. That's why impoppable is so easy. You can sell whenever you want. It's just chimps, but easier. Hmm. I guess we get sharper. That would make sense. Have you played the balloon FPS Apes versus Helium? I have not, though many people have recommended it. Is it just on Steam? I have not looked into it all. Um, Boltress is telling me to try it out. If there was late game selling, it would be easy. Yeah, yeah, it would, because the bad, you could just take it out. Dark Castle is a map that makes a tower defense game a last stand battle. Yeah, dude, it's like Helm's Deep. We go straight to double shot. I think that's the play. See, I forget what we do every time because I'm too busy reading chat to actually commit anything to memory. That's fine, because it's just a struggle every round. It's more fun. It's more fun that way than slowly figuring it out. Any tips for new players? Hmm. I think some good tips for new players is just learning combos that work really well together. Like Alchemist plus a Ninja is like a go-to. Or learning how to counter rounds like 63 is really hard. So if you have like a recursive cluster, or a glaive ricochet you basically beat around 63 stuff like that um as for heroes for beginners i mean i typically recommend either getting sada or benjamin because then you can black border every single uh beginner and intermediate map and then you can unlock all the heroes with that money whereas geraldo is the best hero right now he's a lot harder to use than sada Sada's just uh place and win so yeah, save your cash for heroes and monkey knowledge. Like the best monkey knowledge points are like the extra starting money, the mana shield, the free dart monkey. I really like the extra hero levels, though that one's not as good as the others. The road spikes is super good. 
Can the sniper see through that middle? Yes, sir. But he, he, nothing can like shoot them when they're in the middle. But it doesn't block any line of sight. It's kind of funky. It's a funky map. For sure. Uh, get cross before early game and top path wizard for late. What do I normally get? I, I mean, on beginner maps, you can almost always get away with just Ninja Elk all the way through like the 50s. In late game, if you want an easy one, you can just go pop less druids and an avatar of wrath. That's a classic because it gets the job done on longer maps. Sada is the best hero for early, beginner plus intermediate. Yeah. And then Ben will beat you basically any other map or any other difficulty, really. Ooh. Ooh, I'm silly. I probably should have gotten camera detection over there or used an ability by Sada. Kind of a misplay, but that's okay. The bomb shooter misses so much when going down. How do you upgrade faster? Um, well, you can grind uh, like deflation in oh, grind on infernal deflation to get some free monkey levels. If you're going for tower XP, then I like to grind inflation on resort. It depends on what levels you're talking about. Um, You lost a frickin' 65. Big rip. Um, what's the point of buying the middle thing on this map? Uh, you can place towers up there, though. I don't know. I honestly don't know if it's worth it. I've gotten a buy without doing it so far. It's so expensive. It's too grand. Definitely not going to do it in half cash. That's for sure. Boat farm. Dude, boat farming is really good. Yo, what's up, Luno? Welcome back. Um, what all should we get? Kind of destroying this round. I think what I'm going to do is sell this and this for a super early balloon jitsu this time around. Seems like the play. Seems a lot easier than what I did last time. Wow, way more got through that time. Oh well, probably just placed differently. Get Operation Dart Soon, Dart Storm, and a Bloom Jitsu and Elk. That's all you could afford. Yeah. It's gonna be tough. This is definitely gonna be tough. Alright, so they sell for 1,000. So we need to get to 1970. Alright, we can do that. 1970, we can sell the dart, sell the sniper, get a Bloom Jitsu. Then our only lead popping power is Sada's ability and the bomb shooter, but that's okay. Okay. I'm going to need some better seekings. There we go. It picked up at the end. Uh, let's see. Do maps count as completed if you do them in co-op? No, it keeps track of those separately. It does. It does. All right. Might as well. I want the ace. Because when we tried to do it with just recursives, yeah, I knew it would go to the wrong side. Oh my goodness, dude. Holy cow. I guess we can't get rid of the sniper. This is freaking brutal, boys. Holy cow. You have to do some stuff, Discord, you and Kahoot stars? Well, we're not doing Kahoot today, Tibbers. I have a volleyball to get to, and I did not set one up. Four player co-op half cash is painful and that's a fact. Yeah, it is. That's why I don't typically play co-op. I mean, some I have before. Not really since the incident though, you know? Do the predictions again so you can get VIP faster. All right, after this game, we can do predictions. Probably because we're going to beat this one though, you know? So what all went wrong last time? I thought the early Bloon Jitsu would be a savior. And then without the sniper, we just got destroyed. What's the incident? It's too painful to talk about. I hope you understand. It was brutal though. It had to do with co-op.
you enjoy watching my co-op boss normally whenever i play co-op i just send people money <laughs> and have them beat the map that's my go-to strategy for co uh the yellows come this round don't they oh thank goodness i don't know what round that is but we need to save our money for it uh do you think you'll do a tournament again if it goes well and i think everyone in it had fun so i could see us doing it again especially if battles 2 picks up popularity because i know they're really working on getting rid of like all the lag and all the bugs it's slow it's getting better it's gotten a lot better um so once it's like as refined as battles one, I bet like basically everyone's going to switch over. Is two lives worth it? Sure. Why not? Smelly otters kind of has it down. Not going to lie. All right. I'm okay with that one blue getting through. Maybe we'll mix up. Do I want to mix up the start? We need something camo. Camo. I mean, this guy could pop camos. We tried going for like an A super early to get the discount. It didn't really work. The sniper early is just so good. So we'll continue with that. I'll debate getting another sniper. Loon's game, getting rid of lag. At least you don't play along. <laughs> True. I just don't know what else. I mean, we could get like a 030 druid, but in the meantime, it would be very brutal. Maybe we could get the druid after. Let's get the ninja. Oh, then we're going to really struggle with camos. Dang it. I'd love to get a druid right if we get like a druid up here let's get crazy sada can handle camos and then we can make this guy zero zero two or a zero three two then we have both paths covered for camos and this guy can slowly become a zero three zero you tried again after the tournament and it was really fun yeah no like it's in a much better spot than people give it credit for oh this path is super weak why did i put the druid on the same path as sada that was a rookie mistake Oh my goodness, what was I thinking? Sada can handle all this on her own. Oh golly, one grand? All right guys, I think I made a mistake. It's sad how much the release tainted it. Yeah, I, it was not ready to release. But hopefully it makes a comeback i know btd6 had a pretty slow start for how big it is now so hopefully battles 2 is the same way put you on first put you back on strong if battles 2 about a year and it'll be a really good game same with what happened with btd6 yeah hopefully it's exactly the same because then i think it'll be pretty big It'll be a it'll be a really good game if they uh oh I should have left that on strong. Can we? Alright, that's our lead popping power. Okay. A bit of a different start, but I mean it's kinda cool. I guess. We have lead popping power on both tracks. We have a 030 Druid. Now we just have to figure out a way on how to pop, how to pop round 40. Oh my goodness. Holy cow. Those got far. BTD6 is old. Yeah, it's like four years old now. Dang. Um, we can go. I've seen people do like an overdrive right here. Then I feel like we just completely forget about this path i'm still gonna do it but i don't feel good about it you know we'll just hope that the druid mainly helps out this path which it typically will there we go you got btd6 like two weeks ago yeah dude it's growing it's definitely growing 
it does not act like a like a four or five year old game that's for sure april 1st next year they should remove ranked mode keep casual and bring back every nerfed meta <laughs> yeah right after they get it in like a really good spot they should just troll that would be funny though they just make hydro rocket pods and they bring back all the bugs like the extra pierce tack the uh the extra laser shock laser shock <laughs> all right let's get this I don't think there's a chance. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Vines, please. Thank you. I don't think there's a chance we get to overdrive. So I'm going to just get this guy down for the help. I mean, this isn't horrible. I'm not comfy by any means, though. And I don't even know if we pop round 40. But we'll certainly try. We just changed so much so much up this time around and it's doing surprisingly decent you called it shock stacking it's actually a really good name for it hmm well we can try to get to double shot in time we'll give it our all just pop all those quick we can get to double shot, we actually might take down the mob. We'll definitely try. Using triple shot feels so wrong. It's needed though. It is needed for the early game. Triple shot does fine. It's not as good as the crossbow. It does fine. We can get caltrops, that'd be kind of cool. And then unfortunately, I have to save the ability yeah, I, I had to save the ability for this round. Hopefully we can take it out. Mm hmm. Sada, what in the world are you doing over there? Oh, my goodness. Uh, was that a lot of things? Just get over to battles to oh. Yeah, like the 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 XP grind in the beginning of Battles 2 was absolutely brutal. It's a lot better now though. With universal XP grinding plus like you only need like a third as much to unlock them individually. It's a lot easier to get uh, all the unlock. Am I the only person you think thinks triple shot is a bit worse than BTD5 triple shot? No, BTD5 triple shot was awesome. How? You know, having the camo detection on that dart monkey down there is very nice. Makes our ninja's job way easier. Well, that might be it. We were close to blue jitsu. All right. Uh, feeling good. We can do a prediction, boys. Will this be the one? Will we beat half cash this attempt? Yeah, if we had BTD 5's triple shot, we would have won by now. Ripperoni. Yeah. You know what? I'm off the ace. Ace bad. If we just go back to exactly what we had when we made it to round 64 and changed something, we just went double recursive instead of the ace and it worked very well. Then we lost to Mope. So maybe we could do something like uh, get some Mope Maulers. You will earn your VIP slot and all. Dude, with all these prediction wins. Yeah. So it was like $800 a solo around 39. Yeah. The triple shot in BTD5 was decent. Decent tower. 
What's so special about it? Honestly, you use the engineer. Dude, do you remember the, uh, what was it? The Sentry Mastery on the engineer. So you got the red sentries. That was the most busted thing ever. It was awesome. I remember I, as a joke, would beat maps on like most of the difficulties with exclusively engineers. I would only use it. I forgot about that. Good and bad memories. Sure, we'll we'll take we'll take that blue pop. Oh, another one got through. Feels bad, man. You got this, yo, Jonah. Thank you. I'll do it just for you. Just for us. That was not the best sword I've ever seen, but it helps out with those yellows. It didn't really. All right. We could go dartling. Should I try to save up for a dartling? Would that be silly? I had someone yelling at me to use the dartling the other time. Might as well try it. You never used the, the NG before BTD6 farm format? Use wizard farm and super. Yeah, dude, engineer was always my favorite. Or uh, not my actual favorite, always one of my favorites. Once it was released, and with the red sentries that were absolutely busted, it made it a good time. Darling is too hard. Are you telling me to just stick with the sniper? The sniper go. The sniper makes things easy. Tell you what, what if, and hear me out on this, we get the ace, but we get it now. So we get it cheaper. And then we get a top path or something. Like what if I get like, um, what if I get it like right here? This was probably a mistake, but if it's not, we just saved a bunch of money. I will say I'm easily convinced to not get mortars and dartlings because microing is just beyond me. I will always forget when I am reading chat to micro, so I avoid them at all costs. What do we need? Lead popping power and more camo detection. So I'm thinking ninja. The ace was just a value buy because it was cheaper if we got it first, you know? Oh, hang in there, dart monkey. I'll give you some help. There we go. Once we got the ninja, the dart monkey could keep up. So I just had to help it out a little bit. Ooh. Ninja discipline is such a good upgrade. The mastery stuff was cool. It really was. That was super cool. I mean, it's basically the same thing as as monkey knowledge, except for I say monkey knowledge is a lot more balanced. Because I mean, you just throw on the engineer mastery and you win. Oh, can I get a, uh, I don't even know if my mic picked that up, but that was for you, Perry. Ace micro time. Heck no. Oh yeah. We should probably get lead popping power, huh? I don't know if we'll have enough money. 600, 360. Plus 380, so we don't have enough for that. We have enough for an elk. Stuff is definitely getting through with just an elk, but we'll certainly try. You're on strong, right? That's not the path I wanted Sada to attack. Big yikes. Oh, that is a shame. Not nearly as many leaked as I thought would, though. It was busted, but you can only use one at a time. Could you really? I do not remember that. I was probably just so happy with the engineer. I haven't played BTD5 in probably like seven years. Maybe more. This is why we get the sniper boys. This right here. Ow, that hurts. Anyway, now that we're past that, let's uh, forget about lead popping power for a while.
the nice thing is we have the elk down for futureness so we we just uh we just got that down for a while played a few months ago definitely aged oh it definitely aged you wanted tier fives oh that would be rough to play without <laughs> no tier fives no third path then like, btd5 made or btd6 made some like huge improvements now that i think about it heroes are cool i guess Dude, if BTD6 added another monkey, preferably another water monkey, oh, it would become the best game ever. That would be legendary. All right, let's get double shot. When's the next round with leads? It's gotta be coming up, right? Does anyone know when it is? Not me, that's for sure. I have made that clear. Yeah, so many more towers. Yeah, so many more options. The cross pathings are so cool. Like you can choose uh, based on the scenario. Dare I get AMD? Ooh. Can the ninja handle it on its own? Yeah. All right, we got AMD. We'll pop some leads pretty easily. The only thing is, what do I get now? The bomb shooter? Boring. We could get that druid now. Druid now is not the worst idea I've ever heard. We leaked some. Or if we could get if we could get Berserker Brew, that'd be kind of cool too. They should add Bloon Chipper. That'd be sick. I'd be perfectly okay if they added Bloon Chipper and just made it horrible. They just don't even balance it. Just make it trash. People would be so happy. That might have been a throw, but it could also win us the game. There's no in between. Oh, and the good snipe. Good snipe, Dartling. Or <laughs> Ace. <laughs> Can't believe I call it a Dartling. What an insult to the Ace. Ninja Kiwi said they regret making the balloon chipper. Dude, it was so good. It was awesome. Hashtag bring it back. Even though they likely never will. All right, let's get, um, what, what could we get? That's how it's done right there. Just don't break the ceramics just don't break the ceramics that's the key all right i guess we don't need to upgrade this until around 50 so we can go focus on balloon jitsu or something crazy something wild like that Ooh, this round's scary. Oh, dude, when Sada misses the pinks, that like triggers me more than when uh than when Quincy misses. Cause how do you miss the sword attack? You know? You know, I'm seeing the same pattern with Geraldo. <laughs> I'm seeing it too. Ugh. Well, RJ, you're making it further than me, so that's a that's a plus. The farthest I've made it is 64 so far. We're not even close to Bloon Jitsu. Do I even want Bloon Jitsu? Yes. Bloon Jitsu with Berserker Brew is so good. Last few times we haven't been able to get Berserker Brew. So maybe the early buy will be a, a godsend, you know? Maybe this is the final run. This is the one that will do it. Okay. This is good. Little afraid about leads because we're like super reliant on the alchemist with some super like close timings. Maybe I'll get a sniper. The mobs are too much. Are you balancing mob damage and ceramic control? I'm not. I just lose. That's my key. We don't really have any ceramic popping power right now other than Berserker Brew Ninja. 
could get fighter plane now. I probably should have gotten something else, but oh well, clutch sword. That was nice. Yeah. Once we get sawed as level 10, things get a lot easier, but then we typically lose anyway. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's go for jungle drums. What else would we get? Guys, talk me out of jungle drums. We could also get like a recursive, but recursive, I struggle with them. We could get a boomerang. Hmm. The recursives just always miss because you have to put them in the middle and then they split their attacks and it always underperforms compared to other maps. Yo, what's up, OG? All right, I'm going to get jungle drums and then regret my decision. It's so hard to get to jungle drums. It's more expensive than never miss. However, oh, ooh. we'll just shoot those out. Look at that insta regret. Insta regret or unless we get it, then it will be I'm a genius and I knew exactly how much we would tank. That was I knew we would live with 10 lives there. I knew it. Tax shooter. Honestly, not a bad play. I've seen overdrives right here do very well. I, that was a panic. That was a panic ability. And it's going to it might have been a throw. It's going to be so hard to pop this all these ceramics. Psych. Okay. Do we go for stronger stem? Oh, I haven't even crossed path this yet. You struggled with camo when you went recursive? Yeah, I did too, now that you mention it. I did too. I just realized that this guy popped a ceramic on his own. What the heck? I mean, it got helped by the... Wait, it can't be helped by the ace. Yeah, it popped it on its own. That's crazy. Oh, we're going stronger stim. We're going for it. What's the worst that could happen? What mode am I on? This is half cash. This is the last thing we need. We already took down chimps and a pop lips and every every other game mode. So as I was saying, this is so free. <laughs> this is the most tactical, tactical uh, strategy ever. Like we thought this all through. Never miss would take you to the promised land. We tried that earlier and then we just got smoked. Um, so the one thing is our ace doesn't have counter detection, but that's kind of fine. Oh, just clean up dart monkey. Yes. Yes. Now we have her level 10. 2 HP. Dude, that's all you need. That was a panic use. That was I I did not think the ninja would be able to clean up that easily. Ooh. Okay. Tip stronger stim rarely worth it dude it's carrying will this be a video no sir i mean it'll go out on the vods channel we could get an ever miss we need a global tower we could get a sniper we could go for bouncing bullet i'm so bad at half cash we could get the boomerang 63 is getting scary we could just save for an ods that's what we'll do This round will be a joke. 55, surprisingly easy for how many ceramics get sent at you. You're just always prepared. All 
All right, we'll get our ODS. We'll be happy campers. Get those more powerful missiles. Get the extra darts. Only need a hundred more bucks. Easy. Look at that. Smoking them. And we're up to 27 lives. Huge. All right, now I think we can go for never met. Ooh, maybe we'll get camera detection. Hmm. We don't have enough for camo detection for the camo leads. Well, hopefully, uh, Sada, hopefully Sada and the Bunjutsu can take it out. Does this hit leads? Oh, I forgot about the ones in the middle. Don't at me. We got this. I wonder if Sada's level 10 can take them out, even though they're invincible in the middle. Hmm. All right. Look at that. Free. It's too easy. <laughs> What's up, Vivid? Never miss and use village for camp. Well, that's the plan eventually. Once we get there. Woo. Guys, I'll be honest. I don't think we win still. You want me to put down my Ben before I leave? What do you mean put down your Ben? Are you testing Ben? Seeing if it's possible. You're wondering if I ever played Borderlands. Just wondering because your sniper name is Mordecai. Yes, sir. I love Borderlands. I haven't played too much Borderlands 3, though, but I played the heck out of 1 and 2. I played an absolute ton of 1 and 2. Great games. All right, boys. This is almost tied for the farthest we've been. Uh, but we got absolutely smoked on 64. So we'll see. We'll certainly see. This is more of a test than anything. Hopefully we can handle all the leads. Yeah, that's kind of what I was expecting. One hundred percent of you guys said no. Fair enough. Good luck. Oh, which one? I hosted a boss for someone, but I'm bound to leave after starting. Lol. I don't quite know what that means, but we got this. <laughs> I did not really expect to beat uh, 63 there with our setup. Do I play Apex? I play from time to time. I haven't really played this season. Um, a lot of my friends are way more into it than I am, so I fill in whenever they need a third. How about another poll? We can do another poll. Did I not? There's a poll running, right? Ooh, 15,000 to 20. Most people bet no. But, uh, yeah. I enjoy Apex, but it's not my favorite game. So going back to uh, the menu before dying, not an option. I mean, we never said it wasn't an option. Um, Though... If we had no predictions going, I would probably do it more just to see if we can beat the rounds. But since we have predictions, I feel like it would be scummy to beat the game through doing that. Plus the black border wouldn't feel as good, so we'll avoid it. Um, The ace was nice. We did get farther. So let's try that. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I forgot we have to get our triple dart. Silly me. That's gonna cause me to use an ability early. Yikes. Oh, it didn't matter. All right, let's just get no leaks. 
the new season is really fun but ranked is kind of a grind dude my friends have been complaining about ranked so much because uh the last zone comes down to like 10 people or 10 teams and like you're way more rewarded for getting far than your kills and that's like the opposite of how they like to play also me i just like to hold w harry get out of here don't give them ideas about black border half cash dude i uh i think my game plan is just keep going until i get everyone to bet no like i'll push that at the wrong time all the time and then i'm gonna i'm gonna just steal everyone's schmeckles that was a horrible horrible ability used by me but it was all for that timing look at that how does half cash nerf jerry's nft it's harder to get it's a lot harder to get one sec my headset was dying Ooh, a hydrate thank you i have plenty of water today was the last round the farthest you've got no we got to 64. so basic basically basically the farthest income is the same oh did i leak three no matter what oh are you talking with the nft oh but if you have 20k people bad place when you go negative yeah that um i don't know i like endings in apex where it's like three to four teams and right now it's like eight teams in the final circle and it's just utter chaos which i guess some people like maybe yeah we'll go for the ace again save that extra money i did not like our uh lead popping power though if you guys recall so maybe after the ace we'll get the sniper and we'll just claim that getting the ace now was to save money because if we get them in opposite order we have to spend more you know got my first degree 76 paragon ninja on resort congrats nova congrats dude paragons are super cool i kind of wish they were more useful in normal games but then they would be less cool for bosses and if i got the down earlier it'd pop the yellow for bosses and free play so definitely made free play and bosses cooler the addition of paragons that was a good call by them good addition i just desperately want another monkey and i already said that this stream but one like a like a like a mermaid monkey or like a just like a trident monkey for like a sea water like a water monkey be epic i think that'd be super cool oh ing inguino inguino welcome in yeah if you go late game you basically have to have newcastle or gibby yeah because there's too many teams for how much cover there is it's brutal uh you wish instead of nerfing the tier 5 temples base they just made it decrease damage against bosses i don't even remember them nerfing the damage to be honest with you the vtsg's damage i don't even remember that um will the ace clutch no i should have put that gun strong oh well sup dude not much we're just uh if we beat this we beat we get the black border on x factor and then we have all of them for all the beginner intermediate and advanced maps this is giving me more trouble than gear did that's for sure but we've gotten close there's definitely a turning point i feel like after you beat 64 then the next round hard round is like 76 to 78 you have enough time to prepare and you get a lot of money in those rounds oh crap i have volleyball in 40 minutes and it's a 20 minute drive so this is our last game boys i did not realize that we've already been going for an hour 
split lane half cash is hard yeah it is all right well lg we got this oh rip dang couldn't even help it out it's worth it trust yo c bomb you're coming in right as we're ending not actually ending this is our last run like i said i have volleyball today so we streamed earlier but if we beat it it will all be worth it another day still no medals we'll get it one day i believe We do know that this can beat this round pretty handily. Um, we normally get a bomb shooter. I'm slowly leaning away from the bomb shooter on this map. It's so the two, like even the one zero three, but the two zero three, especially. Oh, oh, what's going on? So many are getting through. Chill. Dang, a lot's got through. What was it saying? It's so good. Um, just not on this map in particular. Can you add BTD6 tower emotes? I have tons of emotes. We're just not a partner, so I can't add anymore. Oh, we have tons of money. What am I doing? Hopefully we can get to a 300 by the boss. That's why we have better TTV. We have a lot of not necessarily tower emotes, but we have a bunch of uh, BTD6 related ones. That's like thousands of leads. Dude, it was actually like a surprising amount. Our sniper could not keep up with how many leads there were. There we go. All right. I've been told, boys, that a 300 nin or elk is all we need. That's so silly that it's better for us to use the ability on the ceramics than the yellows because it maxed out the peers of the impact that's silly to me you one shot the ceramics out of the mob but you don't kill the yellows bizarre anyway how do we want to play this i mean i'm going to a balloon jitsu that's how i want to do it And hopefully we can handle all the ceramics and tell them, but it's not going to be easy. That's for sure. That is for sure. We could always sell the dart monkey down there and maybe the sniper, but that's a risky game. We've tried that before. They just clean up so well. There we go. Easy peasy. Now, do we want to never miss with the alchemist and lack on mob damage or get an ODS and struggle with ceramics? These are the decisions. What else can we get for ceramics? I mean, we can get a middle path sniper, but that's so hard to save up for in this. We could get a boomerang. It's not very good against ceramics. It's mob or that's grouped damage. Let's get a never miss. All right, we're going to go super greed. You ready for this? We're going to go monkey business first. Okay, I'm already regretting going this, but I've committed mentally. You can spam base snipers for the slow. That's actually not the worst idea ever. That's decent. The monkey knowledge slow on ceramics? That's not bad. All options lead to death. Yeah, dude, death is inevitable. RJ, one day we'll beat this. Do you think Bloons is more popular in the Midwest versus other parts of the country? Um, You know, I do not have the stats for what part of the country on YouTube, but it definitely seems to be popular here, so possibly. Yo, the one egg and eerie plays both raiding. Thanks, guys. How's your stream? Welcome in. That's crazy. Back to back, right? Like at the same exact. Okay, 
That one doesn't count. I was very distracted by the raids. I said I wouldn't. Woo! Yeah, dude, the double raid. Holy cow. You guided a raid. Gotcha. Well, thank you. Welcome in, boys. Welcome in. We're trying to, uh, to beat X Factor half cash, though it's not going the best. If we beat this, we get, we get, uh, the black border. Hopefully that, there we go. Okay, that's what I would have done the first time around, to be fair. There we go. You're from Minnesota and you like balloons? Dude, I'm from Minnesota and I like balloons. Crazy. There we go. Take out those ceramics. Probably wasn't quite needed. Um, maybe we'll get a faster throwing go for another one. Uh, we will need camo detection. But guys, thank you for the raids. Thank you, thank you. Thanks for the guided raid, Eerie. Arepa, I should say. I didn't uh, fully read your name. Black borders are hard. Dude, they are. That they are. This is our last advanced map. And then all we have left is expert. All right, let's get jungle drums. It's all up to, uh, I guess we have a lot of things. I was gonna say it's all up to the ninja, but we have Sada and the dart monkey for this round. Should be fine. Eerie is fine. All right, like Lake Eerie. Nice. Jungle drums, hopefully that'll help out the ace to take out all those. Ooh, how did Pat's Pond chimps go? Oh, I did that a long, long time ago. I did that for a guide, probably like a year ago. Oh, well. I don't remember it being particularly hard. You can just start with a sub. Sub dart, I think. If I remember correctly. Um. All right. We kind of have to worry about camo. What we could do... All right, let's get a camo village. This is a bad idea, but and hear me out on this one. We get a camo village, right? How does that go up there? Not well. I lied. We're getting this guy. All right, I want to get a camo village and then get the bottom path. Don't you have volleyball to go to? Yeah, it starts in 32 minutes since a 20 minute drive, so we're going to have to rush. We're going to have to rush. All right, placing that ace down last round was a waste. It did, there's no way it helped enough. But that's okay. Now we have a super cheap ace. A super cheap and never miss. Though the camos will be hard, I will admit. We managed. 1855 piece of cake how hard could it be we've sought it for that one ontario is just canada's midwest <laughs> oh because he's oh 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 we're fine we're fine we're fine the midwest is surprisingly wide i didn't know it went like all the way to ohio i don't know if ohio's in it some people were saying minnesota is not in the midwest they're absolutely crazy there we go all right if we can get this Okay, ooh, I don't know if we can quite get to the Ohio's Midwest, you know, I don't know. Someone was telling me that on stream and I just believe everyone blindly. Josh, you should show up to volleyball early to help set up the chairs. We're the last games. There's games at 6.30, 7.30 and 8.30. So it's all set up. I get to take down the chairs. All right, camos will, the camo leads will be tough, especially since uh, AMD is getting spread out so much. Yikes. Well, we have that. That'll hopefully help. All right, we're kind of cracked. But that means, oh, let's go. You're telling me we have a chance at glory. <laughs> Guys. We're looking good. Am I absolutely terrified of round 63 and this round? Yes. 
absolutely. Wait, I thought you got the black border. This is the last one. We, we beat chimps, but we have, this is half cash. A half cash is the last one we have to beat. All right, you know what? We don't need, we don't need camo detection. We need to beat round 63. And how do we beat round 63? I don't know. Well, we have some money. We have some money. We can't get that. How much does another Berserker Brew cost? All right, we're close enough. We'll get it. <laughs> the one life clutch. All right, well, I guess we'll spend that because we need it. All right, can the second alchemist really help us out that much? No. Dang. We were close, boys. We were close. But like I said, I do have to go to volleyball. Uh, I will be streaming Saturday morning at 8 a.m. Central Time. If you guys are wondering, I wonder if I have the scene set up. I don't. Dang. It is uh, 8 p.m. for me right now. So at 8 a.m., I'll be streaming the boss Saturday morning. And then after the boss, we'll be trying to get that blackboard on X Factor. But I'll see you guys there. Deuces, everyone. Have fun at volleyball. Thanks, man. I think we got it. I think we I th we'll get the dub in volleyball, obviously, but I think we'll we'll beat X Factor next stream. And then we get to move on to the experts because that's the last advanced we need. So. See you, everyone.